He was. 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 He it's a small world, dude. And then I'm going to keep him with the Norway. That's right. That's right. Oh, yeah, the Navy is small. Yeah, the big area is this small. Very small. That's awesome. No, good to meet you, Johnny. God bless you, my friend. Thank you, Johnny. I appreciate you coming here. Thanks for being here. Oh, really? Same circle? It's a small, 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 small world. Wow. I guess I was following him. Oh, At every he left. Oh, you left. When did you leave? Uh, Bahrain? Yes. 2001. Okay. Their circle no, followed his circle. But their circle <laughs> followed his circle. Yeah, so I followed him. Yeah. So you and your wife, when he leaves, you all showing up. Wow. And then the last, I mean, three of them, 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 three of I saw that. Yeah, so it's like, yeah, we're going to go to Behind here? No, right here. Uh, uh, right the Christmas tree. Yeah, right in here with the flag and the tree. Right. I'll just get them out Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, so, you want to do the cake now? What do you want to do with some of those reds? You know what? I can't. Good? Yeah. Um, yeah, let me just get a mic on real quick. Okay. There's going to be five on Friday. You're four. You're four. You would love my little girl. Puppy? A peanut puppy? What's a peanut puppy? Oh, you have a puppy named Peanut. Oh, I love that. They're ready whenever you want. Are we ready? Yeah. That's right. Is there something you want me to like the, the tree with Rufus or something? Or are we going to yeah, like that? Who's, who's, who's going to like them? I want you to do it. They got to switch on it. They got to sit for you to switch. Right, right here, right here. Yeah. So if you want to, when you talk and say it, and then, you know, we're going to go ahead and laugh at you, the memory of our home, and you can okay. switch it, whatever. Hey, guys, if I could have your attention uh, just for uh, just a brief minute. You know, when Rufus told me this was going on today, uh, I had to be here. This means so much to me and so much to the Navy family. Uh, I just couldn't miss it. Uh, I want to thank everybody for being here for one and uh, for... Uh, to Kima and for Melissa and her lovely family, I've got the chance to know, and for Johnny, who I've crossed paths with, 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 whether we knew it or not, over the last 20, 30 years or so, it's been wonderful. But I also want to thank the Gold Star family crew here at Fleet and Family Support Center in the region southeast and up at CNIC for everything that they do with the program and the care and the love they have for all of our fallen shipmates. It means a lot, and it mean, I'm sure it means a lot to the families uh, out there. Uh, and I know it's the holiday season, and I can only imagine uh, the memories it brings back uh, when you don't have your loved one at the, you know, opening the presents or around the, the dinner table. I know how hard that can be. But I hope it's a comfort to know that you've got a family here in the Navy that really cares about you and loves you and wants to support, support you and will never let you down, okay? So on behalf of all the CNIC family and all the sailors out there, you know, God bless you. And uh, thanks for what you've endured. Thank you for your service and your sacrifice and all that. And I will tell you a brief story. Rufus was telling me as we were walking a short distance over here about Takima. Just the other day, she was over at the commissariat exchange over at Mayport. And a sailor, or it could have been a civilian. We, I don't know exactly. I don't know if you know Takima. 
but somebody noticed her car parked in the Gold Star family parking spot. A parking spot that routinely a lot of people do not use. This individual waited beside the car until she came out of the, uh, the commissary or the exchange just to thank her for her husband's sacrifice and to thank her for her strength and uh, just to say, I'm sorry for your loss. I'm sorry for all your losses. And I hope that lighting this Christmas tree here in just a second will get your strength through the holiday season and will keep their memories alive. So, thank you guys for your service and sacrifice. Thank you for what you endured. Thank you for your, your spouse's sacrifice over the years. God bless each of them. With that, I'm going to light this Christmas tree in remembrance of not only your families, but the 70 individuals that are represented on this tree today. May their memories shine bright. All Thank right, you. all right. Thank you all. Thank Rufus? You. Anything you want to say, Rufus? Yeah. Just echoing what the Admiral has already indicated, our survivors, they're the utmost. They're the strength behind what we do. They're the ones that encourages us to continue to do on, go on and support them no matter how hard it may be. We try to bring joy into their lives, although they've given the ultimate sacrifice of their fallen heroes. And for that, we can never repay you. We can only say thank you, thank you, thank you.